Sup guys, Barry Boo, and today we're gonna be doing something mighty insane, and it's gonna be called doing the cafe side quest and the opponent side quest all at once. Yeah. So the first thing we're gonna do, I've actually never done this before, so we're gonna see if it bombs. Okay, play the song. Wait. Wait, we're, I've never done this before, so we're going to test this theory out um, on record. I don't know how many episodes this is going to take. It might take quite a lot of episodes, because we're going to be doing a, a lot of side quests. So, first we're going to go this way, speed running with Goron Link. We're going to get the cafe mask. It's one of the easiest masks to get in the game. Um... 10 a.m. Huh. Okay. So we gotta wait till it's 10. So we're gonna go do something else in the meantime. And that's gonna be getting a big bomb. See, I'm, I'm already screwing this up. Okay, so in between this episode and the last episode, I had some spare time before I reset the days. So I got 720 rupees now. So how much do powder cakes cost? I think they cost 50. So we're just going to get 60 just in case it's more than that. So we got to go in here and get a powder keg. Let's go get a powder keg from Mr. Goron buddy right here. Hey bud, get up. Give me a powder keg. Oh, of all places. We're going to see if they have a powder keg, right? Yeah, 50 rupees. Okay, I'd have messed up. It's 50 rupees. So the next thing we're going to do... Our kegs are extremely volatile. Blah, 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 blah. Now we're gonna go train for the aliens in Romani's ranch. Because what you gotta do is train for the aliens so that you can get Epona. So that you can get into a kind of valley and you can get into this, the Great Bay Coast. Let me go get some magic real quick. And some arrows, because I need some arrows. Whatever. Where, where did that guy even go? He just disappeared. Give me your stuff. Well, I got more magic. Arrows! Oh. That didn't work. I am just a, I'm a mess right now. We gotta go do something until 10 o'clock. Okay, let's, um... Let's whack a, a, a back. Holla back in the woods with a country folk who got it so good. Okay, gimme. Let's get our powder keg out. Do you hate it when I say powder keg? I don't care. Hey buddy, better get out of the way. And I know it explodes pretty quickly, but I'm impatient, so we're gonna do that. Yeah, subscribe. Sorry, I didn't mean to just tell you to subscribe. What is wrong with me? Here we are. Remini Rants. Remini Rants. And uh, we're going to talk to Cremenia. Oh my, did you come from town? Yes. Then that means Milk Road is open to traffic. Good, I can deliver milk to town now. Welcome to Romani Ranch, Chateau Romani's village. Enjoy yourself. Thanks, Crimea. Crimea. I I have to see her name again before I can say it. Look. What is it, Tattle? Oh, it's my horse. Though I couldn't ride as a pony in the first game, but for some reason, I can ride as a pony in this game. I'm gonna scare you, but I'm still Link. Just remember. I'm still a link. Okay, I can't talk to Romani like this, can I? She's just gonna be like, ooh, you're a rock or something. Hey, who are you? Oh, that's my first time meeting a foreigner. You're cute. Thank you. Look, I'm actually a boy. Who are you? I'm Romani. I was gonna say this. Are you, are you... I won't say my name since you're not gonna say it anyway. Are you racist to Gorons? How about Grasshopper? I actually don't like Grasshopper, and I don't like to just talk in the third person, but let's practice. They are coming. No. 
Who are they? They, they come at night every year when the carnival approaches. They just like to party at the carnival. It's just what they like doing. They just like partying. I don't know why are you getting so down on them, Armani. I mean, you like to party, right? I mean, what if I told you every time you went to the park? Okay, I'm done. If you're new to my channel, I'm sorry for the rambling. They, they look like alien ghosts. And they take the cows with giant udders. And then they come to the barn. Ah, my old sister won't believe me. Why doesn't she believe you? She's stupid. You need an assistant. You're a boy. Won't you try it? Yeah. Why does it matter that I'm a boy? You have a bow. You could shoot him. I'll aim and you get arrows and do this. Blah, 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 blah. Sorry about that, Romani. I just didn't want to hear what you had to say. Um, you she makes you train on horseback, but it's not actually good to do on horseback when you're actually doing it. It'd be the worst idea. Miss it both times. I'm not good at this, and I don't even care. You guys can tell me how terrible aim I am. I can partially blame the control I'm using. Yeah, if I'd have missed that, I'd just killed myself. Uh, but you know, I'll just blame the rest on that I'm bad. There's seven left. Huh. Come on. Why am I even? Why am I even like? I can spam arrows. I've got endless ammo. Turn around, Epona. Oh, there's not seven left. There's ten targets, and I had seven. Boom, got it. Yeah, we're done. I'm the best. <laughs> I'm the best. Ah, minute 45. That's really slow. You work perfectly together. I can't believe you said it's great. Hey, horse. Teach a song to call the horse. Oh, you sound like you got quite a set of pipes. And by pipes, I mean it sounds like you've got little like organ pipes. And not like organ organ pipes, but like organ organ pipes. I put pictures on the screen so that what I made just made sense. Let's play this song. <laughs> you got Epona's song. You got Epona's song. So it's kind of weird. Like Link and Epona are the only ones that aren't from the alternate universe in this game. Yeah, uh, yeah, I got that. Sure, I didn't speed you up. Operation starts tonight at 2. I'll be waiting in the barn. Don't be late. I won't be late, but I will be doing quite a few other things during this whole ordeal. Like getting chickens. Let's go get some chickens. Okay, um, hey, buddy. What's up? He's like, heard it from my gramps. Says the moon's gonna fall. With something that big, I'm sh I sure to take the down ranch with it. <sighs> oh well. He starts looking around with his big creepy head. That was mean. My only regret is that I won't get to see these guys and their prime as roosters. Well, let's help him out. With the power of slavery. Hey, Barry Boo, um, can you speed this up and put a remix that you find online of this song? If you don't find a remix, then put a song that reflects something else, because, you know, I want a remix, and hopefully you can get permission for the remix. Remember guys, never let go of the B button during this, because they will all, they will all leave you and run back to their original positions, and that is bull, and nobody wants to have to go through that. We've almost got all the chickens. Yeah, he says he doesn't, he, he misses that he won't be able to see them in their prime as roosters, but they aren't roosters, they are all chickens. Ah, I don't get it, but I don't have any regrets about anything anymore. And I got the bunny hood. Yeah, <laughs> these guys are all roosters. Oh, I'm so glad that he thinks they're roosters. But you know, if he, th if he wants to believe they're roosters, who am I to tell him to stop? I mean, it it's not going to hurt him any believing they're roosters. He's not going to leave this ranch anyway. So I'll let him just think they're roosters. I mean, what what's the harm? Okay, where's my horse? Let's go get another mask. We're just going to get masks all over the place in this episode. 
Now, I never really use Epona except for mandatory times because I going to Goron is so much faster. So I'm gonna just say now that Epona is a little obsolete. Besides, just like she's kind of like an item to me. I don't use her as a mode of transport. But I'm only using her now because, well, I'm gonna have to use her here anyway. Hopefully, ten rupees is enough. Because <clears throat> I think I only have ten rupees. Because I gotta race these guys. Um, we gotta hope that however many rupees I have is enough. Epona, what are you doing? Okay, stop. Let's talk to him. Is that pathetic thing your horse? I would have guessed a thing like that was a mule for sure, ain't that right, little brother? Do you think a horse that pathetic would gallop if you- Actually, they're just telling me how to f ride a horse. Give us ten rupees to race. If you win, we'll give you something nice, kid. Race! It's a simple race. Just go once around the track. If you can beat us to the finish line, you win. <laughs> you ready? I'm ready. I'm ready. You wanna go? I'm pretty bad at racing. I've explained that in Ocarina. But let's see if we can beat them anyway. Because they got endless carrots. I don't. Oh, oh. Pass me up. Oh, trees. They're throwing some obstacles my way. There's some sneakies. Come on. Come on. No. No. Well, I know that this will win this. Because my horse knows how to jump fences. You guys just don't. Yeah, we're gonna win. Hearts. Da na na. I wanna be the very best, like no one ever was. Bow now, now, now. Catch them is my real test. To train them is my cause. I win. I don't know why I always thought those were so hard when I was a child. I'm like, I can't believe we lost. Big bro, I wonder if we can give this to this guy. We gotta give him something. Well, he's a kid, so what can he do with it? It should be fine. You got the Garrow's Mask. Yeah, this is the mask that I was calling Don Garrow's Mask. Because they have similar names. In fact, they don't at all. They just... Well, they do. Let's not beat bushes. Here it is. I look like a Garo. We haven't seen a Garo in the game yet, but... But, but boy, when we do... Alright, so to wrap up this episode... Or, I don't know, will this wrap up the episode? Will it be way too short? Oh, I'm all the way across the world. Isn't that just lovely? Um, we're gonna go get the stone mask. Because I love the stone mask. Because it makes one part in the game. Well, I guess two parts if you don't like doing the stealth part. And I have to say, I don't like doing the stealth part. I, I mean, I love Metal Gear. So you'd think I would like the stealth part. But I don't. Anyway... But, you know, the part that I don't like is the freaking part with... Okay, um, what am I trying to say? It's the part with the little black thingies in the mirror room. That's the main reason why I ever get the stone mask more than any other thing in the world. Um, we're gonna take off this mask and we're gonna say, hey, Pona, come on, let's hop over this fence real quick. Stop. Okay. Turn. Fix the camera. Go. Thank you. Okay, so in order to do this, you've got to put this on and then do this thing and do this thing and that thing. And you got to say, buddy, what's up? I can see you. And he's like, don't tell me that's I'm shocked you're the first one who's ever spoken to me. I've been here for many years, waving my arms around and asking for help, but everyone ignores me, passes me by. It's because I'm about as impressive as its own, right? I'm used to it, though. Um, I have a request. Can you give me some medicine that would make even an unnoticeable stone like me feel better? Okay, here you go. Ah, that is... Is that it? He's like, gulp, 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 boom. And he's better! And now all I see is his bottom half. I feel better, I think. This is awkward. Thanks. Oh, here. In gratitude. You got the stone mask. And there's an arrow. Um, he used to be an adventurer like me. Until he took an arrow to the abdomen. Now let me practice here standing out. 
All right. Yeah. And now he's visible. Why was he invisible? The game never goes into detail about this. But you don't need to when you're Zelda because you're awesome. Thank you guys for watching. See you next time. We're going to keep doing more side quests. So if you don't want to watch that, I'm sorry. You probably shouldn't tune in next time. Uh, later.